creature. The dog in the shadow. A dog crossing a rivulet with a piece of flesh in his mouth saw his own shadow represented in the clear mirror of the stream and believing it to be another dog who was carrying another piece of flesh, he couldn't forbear catching at it. But it was so far from getting anything by his greedy design that he dropped the piece he had in his mouth, which immediately sunk to the bottom and was irrevocably lost. Application. Base is the man who pines amid his store, and fat with plenty, griping covets more. Excessive greediness, in the end, mostly misses what it aims at, and he that catches it more than belongs to him justly deserves to lose what he has. Yet nothing is more common and at the same time more pernicious than this selfish principle. It prevails from king to peasant, and all orders and degrees of men are more or less infected with it. Great monarchs have been drawn in by this greedy humour to grasp at the dominion of their neighbours. Not that they want anything more to feed their luxury, but to gratify their insatiable appetite for vain glory. And many states have been reduced to the last extremity by attempting such unjust encroachments. He that thinks he sees the estate of another in a pack of cards, or a box and dice, and ventures his own in the pursuit of it, should not repine if he finds himself a beggar in the end. All right.